Learning API testing is mandatory. Yes, you heard it right. Before you give me any heat on this, right, I'm going to tell you about a very important instance, which is I was just discussing about one of the SME. He has almost like 16 years of experience as a manual tester, right? Right now he's a QA director, but I asked him, right? So basically my question was, what is the one thing that you recommend right now for a manual tester to learn? Even as a fresher or someone as a manual testing, right? What is the one thing that they should immediately learn, right? And the answer was APIs. Right. So I was not surprised on this because whatever jobs that right now you see, right, API testing is kind of mandatory by default, even if the profile is for a manual tester, right? They always include that you should have an idea about the SOAP, REST, other things, right? APIs tools like for example, Postman, by default they have added in the description, right? In the job description, it is automatically added by default, right? That's why I always recommend to my students, right? See, direct jumping from manual to automation through web automation, right? It is difficult because many times what will happen is in APIs, if you know, right, it is divided into API testing manually, then we have API automation, right? So if you understood the API testing manually first, right, trust me, API automation, I think it's a little easier if you are a decent in the program. For example, suppose I'm considering right now you're decent enough in the core Java itself, right? So REST assured library it can be used for API automation, right? It's a little easy as compared to the traditional web automation, which is Selenium, where you have to learn about the patterns and other things and all, right? Which I think super easy. And this is not me, actually, many of my students also uh, consider this that yes manual testing api and then automation makes sense like step one step two and step three on this one right another important point is uh, as a manual tester whenever you guys are testing any application for example suppose you're you're testing a login page right and you have just entered username and password you clicked on login button nothing working in your console you checked okay there is a 500 error which is coming right then api testing or basically knowledge of that api become necessary right isn't it what do you think type yes in the comment if you think that because when i was testing this uh, login scenarios, registration scenarios, anything, right? All this basically makes sense because all the UI that you are testing as a manual tester, right? Depends upon this API, which is application programming interface where business logic is already written, right? So overall, the failure, most of the time you will see in the business logic layer, right? Where when you basically debug this login page, right? Why this is failing? Then you got to know that, okay, this there is an API, which is giving you some kind of error, which is a 500 error kind of a status code on this, right? So that's why I think learning API testing is super important for now nowadays and I highly recommend you there are multiple multiple videos that I have created I have created 30 days of a postman to get started as a beginner in API if you are a fresher or manual tester I would recommend you to check it out right there is a 30 days of automation testing uh, API automation that I have done rest assured free course custom framework that we have created I will put the link below please check it out and I will highly recommend you to go ahead and learn the API testing this should be your second step even if you're a fresher even if you're a known IT person I think learning API is super important and mandatory now Days, right this is my recommendation right thanks for watching this video if you agree on this just type agree in the comment if you disagree just type disagree on in the comment below right i think we should be clear right which one we have to learn right i hope this is clear guys thanks for watching this video and automation tester blueprint is now live guys where if you're a fresher or a manual tester want to learn about the automation we are covering api also in this case right it's a 4.5 monthly live course batch almost like 100 plus hours that we are basically going to give and new year we are targeting to become an automation tester i hope you wanted to become let's crack it and let's become an automation tester through the live batches through interactive classes multiple people have done it people have got 10x of the value right link in the description do check it out and thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video bye